Hey, this is 5924. Uh, we are SI Robotics, and we are a rookie team this year for FRC. Well, we have a pretty exciting robot, especially for a rookie team. Uh, we knew we wanted to do a low bar robot, if not the first day, by the second day, uh, because we figured if we could do that uh, consistently, that would be one easy defense to do. Um, um, we really knew that based on all the defenses, we wanted to have a good drivetrain, something that had a lot of power and could get over the rock wall, the moat, um, and the rough terrain. Uh, we're working with the six wheel drivetrain. Uh, the middle wheels lowered a bit. We're using pneumatic wheels because we saw early on that was going to be really popular and really useful for getting over some of the defenses. So we added some wheels, uh, four inch wheels, in between the wheels, and then we added a back one that was active. The other ones are passive, and then so we could more easily go over some of the defenses, namely the moat. And we also wedged the front so that we could uh, go over some of the defenses more easily so we can able, the first point of contact would be the drivetrain wheels rather than the frame. We also have a really unique shooter. Uh, we're using a flywheel system uh, with two bag motors with a couple of four inch wheels um, to, you know, kind of like a pitching machine. We use wheels to um, push the ball in and out and the mechanism goes up and down with a uh, dart um, actuator. And that allows us to angle the, the shooter so that we can give it a desired angle and we can use it for uh, adjustable high goal shooting as well as lifting its play defense. Uh, our, our shooter has an arm that folds out from on top of it. So the arm is for um, lifting the portcullis and putting down the cheval de Prix. Uh, so we're definitely able to take out most of the defenses uh, we'd be able to breach on our own. Uh, and our teammates could focus on either defending or on shooting. We've noticed that it takes teams a lot of time to line up their shots. Uh, so we're sort of prioritizing breaching overshooting uh, for now because that's what we're better at. I think our general strategy is to uh, shoot low goals and uh, work to get the rank point for breaching the defenses every match. If needed, we can make some low goals and possibly high goal shots. If we have the opportunity of having some good shoot shooting robots on our alliance, we'll also play defense.